Okay, so you will go into the folder that you will put the assessment. You will click Add Materials. You will click Add Assessment. Then you will put in the name of the assessment, which is Highlight Site Word C Assessment. Add the due date. And this is going to be three points. Make sure for submission you enable. No need for password. Category assessment. And then you click create. Instruction. We are going to type the instruction in Word. Copy it. Then we'll paste it here, add a color to it, check all your settings, and apply whatever you, you think is necessary. We will apply this one, attempt, three times, and leave the highest score, and then we click save, then we go to add questions, then we click highlight text, click the table, then you're going to add the rows we're going to use for this one, two rows and three columns. And then table style, you may hover and border. You click OK and here you have the table style. Now you're going to add the words, copy. We're going to add C in the first column. So we paste all the C, we can change the size when we're finished. Then we put in U, all the site word that you want to put in. Put U one place. Then we put in the next site word me. It's up to you the site words that you want to put in. In another space. Then you put my in another space. And then you're going to adjust your work so that it's suitable for your students. Make it bold, change the size, and you can play around with this part as much as you want. Put it in the center. Now, Possible response is word, apply word highlight, existing highlights will be replaced and any correct responses will be removed. Okay. Then correct answer setup. We're going to click the correct answers. Then exact match, make sure that's on. Then we save it. Then we put in the points. It's three correct C's. So three points. Then we preview. Then start new attempt to view it from the child's perspective or your students. Then you can attempt to do it. Highlight C. Highlight, 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 then review, finish, close preview, and that's it.